What's up guys? It's your boy Wolver Guy here with another Madden video. Welcome to the Friday weekly update. Hope you guys are having a great Friday, ready for the weekend, ready to see that Eagles ass kick the living shit out of the Patriots. I'm hoping, I'm hoping. So um guys, um if you guys watch this video, Go down to the comments and tell me who you're rooting for in the Super Bowl. Obviously, you guys know that I don't stand. I don't like the Patriots. I like Tom Brady because he was from Michigan, but the hell franchise, ugh, yeah, you, you you know. So uh, let me know what uh you guys who you guys are rooting for Sunday in the Super Bowl. But with that being said, um, so Wednesday I talked about the new stuff with the Super Bowl. I got these Super Bowl challenges done. And I got the legend um, challenges done as well. Also, I got all the gauntlet stuff done as well. Didn't really pull anything out of there other than getting some coins. We're going to pull a Lombardi pack to see if we can pull anything. And uh, I will tell you guys one last time what my lineup is and what the gauntlet chemistries are and all that stuff. So, with that being said, we're going to head right into the solo challenges. Now, they have predictor challenges. I did one of them today so I could do... Uh, the other dailies so do my win my two challenges and get that done um, so we're gonna talk about the gauntlet too. gauntlet if you guys did this week there's no requirements there's no chemistries you guys need so you guys can have the best lineup as that you have you know put all your great your good cards in don't need no chemistries this week which was nice so I'll be doing these three later today and I'll tell you guys if I pull anything good or not. Last week I pulled an L. Uh, so the Super Bowl challenges, there's 31 of them. There's a daily, um, the history of the Super Bowl. You do, you get all these done and you get um, the rest of those Super Bowl players that you have to put in your lineup. You have to have 10 of them, you put them in there and then you do these challenges. And then any of those new, these, this is Nat obviously, Put all those 85s in that you get and you finish all of them you get a choosing of what you want um but what i mean by that is all those new super bowl players that came out we'll talk about my lineup here in a second uh so i preferably picked um i didn't know if i wanted to go with a safety a corner or a outside linebacker because their middle linebacker was absolute garbage and I'm like, you know, I don't want to grab him. Uh, so you can get any of these cards. You have one choice. You can get the Warner. You can get the Davis. You can get the Franco Harris. Warfield, Little, Hendricks, Lanier, Ware, uh, Willie Brown, Rodney Harrison. And that's your choices. Now, I was like, I don't know who to pick. And so what... I picked was Demarcus Ware and I thought you guys are probably gonna be like why he's super slow well if you guys have the Suggs that I have compared to him 93 to a 95 there's probably not much because there's some pretty big dudes we're going to um, compare we're gonna compare him now if you look down he is worse in every category over where where has 10 more speed um, just four more strength, uh, one better tackle, one better recognition because of the chemistry. Block shedding is up by one. Power move is up by one. The finesse is up by four. And the hit power is up by two. And look at the strength, guys. 93 compared to an 89. His agility is 88 compared to... I can't really tell because it's in red numbers. Um... But his speed is an 87 compared to his 77. And his Excel is 91 for a huge motherfucker like that is incredible. And I have played with him uh, a few solo challenges. And he is just a beast, guys. So if you guys haven't done these challenges yet and you're deciding who you should get, put in the consideration of this right outside linebacker, DeMarcus Ware. With this kind of speed, this he... Madden was very giftful to this card because they have never given him high speed ever. Um, also, I did the Khalil Mack. I bought for 200k the card I needed to finish the power up set. We got him at 2 and 96 instead of a 95 with a tier 4 power up. 
and then basically everything else is the same so those are the only two cards that really changed on my lineup and then i'm using basically everything else is the same also i don't know why i have this paul warfield in here he's not a bad receiver but i need something better than that so we're going to put in who do we not have in lineup we're gonna put that michael irving and also the tire or the not the tyree kill but the damien thomason i will have that done for you guys in a few days so i'll let you know what is the comparison to both of those cards as well um i think it's pretty much the same just you get a times two toughness chemistry which is going to be nice for the demarcus Ware and anyone else that has toughness so that is my lineup right there um we're going to open today's quick sell pack and daily objective pack that i finished and see if we can get any quick sell going hopefully we can get some decent coins i made about 15 or 1700 last night on the super bowl collectibles because i did all those sets so we're gonna get the collectibles and we're gonna get two of them so which means i have three so i can pull one quick sell real quick so we're gonna go super bowl item and then we're gonna pull that come on give me at least five grand i'd be happy with that we're only gonna get a thousand that sucks but money is money so we're only gonna pull a thousand out of that and so they've been adding limited time super bowl cards and i've seen um a couple youtubers pull some uh cards out of this lombardi i have not been able to pull anything other than low elites um i have nothing to do with my uh money right now well, I mean, I'm not really saving up for anything. I really have everything that I want at a reasonable price right now. The only thing that I would save my money up for, but it's so expensive right now, is the Haha -ha Clinton Dix uh, free safety uh, snow beast card. But I can't necessarily do that right now because everyone wants about over 200k and that card's only in 93 so i don't believe it should be 93k so we're gonna get 10 grand out of this one which is nice and that'll go towards the lombardi pack that we pull so hopefully we get something good out of this pack i have not been able to pull shit out of this pack guys so we're going to find unless they took away the lombardi packs i don't think they did Lombardi 60k down the drain. Let's see what we get Probably shit All right, so we're gonna pull silver Another silver. Let's see. What's this end of the pack silver? We're gonna pull an 87 Jamie Collins a 92 Ronald Darby And a gold 71 right end so those cards guys that I just pulled finally something out of this pack oh my god that is nice 92 corner and he is actually worse than josh norman and he's about the same uh with champ bailey they have better stuff so an 87 and a 92 darby which is very nice so we're gonna see i'm gonna be able to make my money back on this card probably even more so let's see what I can pull out of this pack or out of these cards money wise. So we're going to go into this 87 first and he goes for the easy 7k so we can make about 7k back. That Darby is probably pretty nice. Um, I would probably play him uh, over Champ Bailey but Champ Bailey is such a good card. I don't want to stop using him right now. Um, so I don't know why I'm going this high. I'm just rambling on and I am paying attention So we're gonna just say screw it. We're gonna sell it for 72 or to buy out of fucking You know 72 you buy it for fucking seven grand. So I only get like 6k. So this 92 Let's see how much it is and this card goes for about 80k So we're gonna make a little bit of profit off of this not much but that is pretty that's a pretty cheap 92 corner right there um that chemistry would be very nice right now uh um since i have him and him but to see the thing is he's got to pick six perk which is really nice and all my corners have this blanket coverage um but compared to norman 
he has man coverage, but his zone is terrible. Uh, his agility is about the same. The speed's about the same, and speed's uh, an acceleration too. Champ Bailey, he's got a little bit better speed. His agility is the same. Man coverage is better. His zone co coverage is horrible. His press is pretty good compared to Champ's, and then uh, the play recognition is about the same, and the catch is about the same. So the only thing he has over him is man coverage and press. So this card is really not that good, guys. Uh, so if you pull this, sell it for money. Get your money back and see what else you can pull. So 70, he goes for 78.5 right now. So we will sell him for 78.2 and get make some a little make some money back on this. And hopefully his card doesn't drop too much in price. That he's such a easy pull. I would love to get an ultimate time drop, but I've I'd never in the two and a half years I've played ultimate team. I've never been able to get unlimited card without buying him. So uh, we, I think that's what the price was 78. I can't remember because I, I just kind of went off. So let's see what it is. Okay. So that's what, okay. So I think my, yeah, that's fine. It will sell. Those cards will go eventually and if i don't like the price i'll check back later and readjust that price and see what we can get now you know what? I, i'm feeling pretty i'm feeling lucky right now we pulled something like that so i think i'm going to try and pull one more lombardi pack before i end the video um because i'm not really doing anything with my coins so we're gonna just spend my coins on this and see what we get we get another ronald darby what this is crazy oh my god we're gonna pull a gold. We're gonna pull an 83 Chris Matthews, another gold, and another gold. So we just pulled two Ronald Darbys. I just pulled two 92 Super Bowl cards. This is insane. I was, I seen one, I seen that 92. I was hoping it was a limited time, but that is about 140K I'm gonna be able to get back here, guys. And plus I can sell that Chris Matthews as well. So, he is going for 7400 We'll put him out for 7200 and get some money back. We're going to make some profit off of these two packs. That is really great. So I don't know if Madden got so many complaints that these cards were terrible. And they wanted to say, hey, at least put some good cards in there so we're not just dropping 60 on a couple of these bow elites that you know only cost about if you pull two of them it's only going to be like 14k or something so 7800 we will sell him for I, th I think i'll i think i'll put him out there for 77 but that is insane guys i just pulled two ronald darby's back-to-back -back packs i've never ever 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 pulled a pack like that and pulled the same high tier card out of that 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 is that is absolutely insane um, that makes me kind of want to save this card, but his stats are not good at all. So we're going to go 77 and 77 5 and sell those two cards. That is crazy, guys, that I just pulled two of those. It's not, not good cards, but um, I'm pretty shocked that I just pulled that because I really thought I wasn't going to get shit out of that pack. So um, I can't necessarily do anything else with my coins i think i might be able to pull a couple gold for you guys and see if i can pull anything out of that um so let's go to players we're gonna go over to gold packs um i can't pull 30 so we'll be able to pull i think two of these maybe one of these because it's 75 uh, okay so let's see if we pull any elites we don't pull any elites we got nine grand uh we're gonna try and pull another gold pack and see what happens I'm, it's really rare to get elite cards out of these gold packs anymore unless you get the premium, which is like a little bit of a boosted. And we're gonna get another gold. So we didn't pull anything out of these gold packs. So that'll do it for today's video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Drop a like if this video was helpful to you guys or you enjoyed it or both. Also, if you guys have any comments, questions, or concerns, say something down in the comments. If you are confused about something in Ultimate Team, I will try and help you guys out to my uh, fullest knowledge of ultimate team so that being said like i said hope you guys enjoyed the video hope you guys have a great weekend hope you guys have a great friday and hope 
the Eagles win the Super Bowl. I'm really hoping they should really win, man. It's, they've, been in the, they've been in the drought for the playoffs for a long time, and this team's coming around. So hopefully that defense can just shut down Tom Brady, and that will be the game. So with that being said, hope you guys have a great weekend in general, and I'll see you guys sometime next week. Take care. Bye-bye.